ship sailed on the North Country. She went by the name of the Green Willow Tree. I fear she'll be taken by the enemy as she sails on the lowland low. As she's sailing on the lowland low. She hadn't sailed far out upon the lowland sea. When the lookout cried, here comes the enemy, and the name of the ship was the Golden Vanity, she came sailing on the lowlands low. Then up to the captain steps the cabin boy, saying, what will you give me if I can't destroy? You can give me I only daughter for your wedding joy, if you sink her in the lowlands low. He says to the captain, an auger give to me, and for your daughter's hand I will sink the enemy. Then he swam through the waves to the golden vanity, for to sink her in the lowland snow, to sink her in the lowland snow. He pulled out the auger and he swam down to bore. He made nine holes in the bottom of the floor. The crew hadn't to know just what they had in store as they sailed on the lowlands low. Some were playing cards and some were at the dice and some were simply standing round and giving good advice. When in came the North Sea and it rose up past their eyes and they sank into the lowlands low. It sank them in the lowland snow. Oh, Captain, oh, Captain, take me back on board. I've done as you asked, now I claim my reward. Oh, be unto me just as good as your word, for I'm drifting in the lowland snow. But then up spoke the captain, my word I will not keep. For though you are brave, your life to me is cheap. You cannot have my daughter, instead forever sleep. I sink you in the lowland snow. Took him to the side, and they they wrapped him up in an old cow's hide. They lowered him overboard for to go down with the tide. They sank him in the lowlands low. They sank him in the lowlands low.